Welcome to the Humanities Team Podcast with me, Steve Farrell. Humanities Team is an international spiritual movement whose purpose is to communicate and demonstrate the timeless truth that we are all one, with the divine and all life, caring for each other and the world we share, so that people's actions reflect this profound understanding within our generation. We believe that living this truth is essential to resolving the most chronic and acute world challenges and vital to creating a flourishing world of peace, harmony, and happiness. We offer transformative education programs in personal and spiritual development, and we host an annual event called Global Oneness Day. Similar to Earth Day, which galvanized the global environmental movement, Global Oneness Day has become a catalyst for spiritual activism and an integral part of the present-day global oneness movement which represents a profound new paradigm in human culture. Humanities Team is the only global nonprofit organization working in transformational education. Since we are a nonprofit, there is no focus on growing profits or satisfying shareholders, and 100% of all revenue goes toward our work supporting conscious evolution, planetary awakening, and flourishing at every level of life. If you'd like to learn more about us or want to support our mission directly through donation or volunteering some of your time, please visit us online at humanitiesteam.org. And lastly, if you enjoyed this podcast, we'd be grateful if you'd leave us a review. Hi, everyone. I'm Steve Farrell, the Worldwide Executive Director for Humanities Team, and welcome to this 15-minute very special program with Jonathan Goldman. Jonathan is a dear friend of Humanities Team and Global Oneness Day. He has created a sound healing moment just for Global Oneness Day 2016. Let me introduce him briefly. Jonathan Goldman is an international authority on sound healing and a pioneer in the field of harmonics. He is an author and is the director of the Sound Healers Association and president of Spirit Music, Inc. Jonathan is the double winner of the, and of the Visionary Awards for Best Healing Meditation Album and Album of the Year. He is a lecturing member of the International Society for Music Medicine. He has dedicated his life to the path of service, helping awaken and empower others with the ability of sound to heal and transform. And welcome to Global Oneness Day, Jonathan. It's great to have you with us. Steve, it is such a blessing to be here with you and all the listeners and all the beings who are perhaps unconsciously just feeling the vibrations of our sounds together. What a blessing. Thank you. Oh, nicely put. And, of course, you usually uh, frame your music this way, the the frequency of the uh, music. But it's true, isn't it, that uh, where we come together in this way for where we're devoted to to healing the earth, is, which is what uh, Global Oneness Day is, where we're awakening oneness, and, and also your your uh, Sound Healing Day, which is in uh, on Valentine's Day every year. That's right, uh, World uh, Sound Healing Day. <laughs> World Sound Healing Day. That's right. This is what it. This is what we're doing. So I know uh, you know we're, we're going to have this conscious enhanced listening experience here in just uh, a few minutes. But uh, Jonathan, yeah, can you uh, walk us in and and just tell us? A little bit about this piece and or and or inspirations that you have around Global Oneness Day that you'd love to share with listeners this year. Well, you know, basically, I'd just like to, for a moment, just talk about uh, sound and the fact that most people don't realize that sound is actually a very powerful energy. And one of the things that it does, even when we're just listening, is sound goes into our ears and into our brain and affects our nervous system our heart rate, and our respiration. And uh, so many things can happen uh, when this occurs, including the fact that we begin to resonate, vibrate, and then train together and be as one. And I think that's one of the keys to being the global oneness is to be as one. And, you know, first of all, there is breath because there is no sound without breath. But the next step beyond breath is sound. So if we listen and breathe together, we can really help co-create, shall we say, an interface with what I call the Gaia matrix or the energy of Mother Earth. Beautiful. Well, and you've even created this equation, frequency plus intent equals healing. 
which so mm-hmm. many people talk about. Yes, and uh, so we're uh, we've all created a beautiful intention here on this day, Global Oneness Day, that we awaken to oneness and feel our oneness because this unity doesn't exist, does it? The uh, in, in truth, we are all one, and we always have been, but uh, we're we just are all our one. oneness. Yes, it's a it's a, just an amazing phenomena for us to really begin to come back to that place of oneness because for some reason uh, a lot of uh, a lot of our species has forgotten how interrelated we are and you know thank goodness for things like uh, quantum mechanics and the you know ancient mystics and the uh, modern physicists who tell us that everything is is in a state of vibration they also tell us that everything is interfacing and basically basically coalescing together so we are all one whether we are aware of it or not but if we become aware of it it really enhances the experience yes it does and if oneness is ultimate reality then to enhance the experience and really live in it and embody it express it um, what what better way to spend our life huh than to really consciously live in the truth of who we are Oh, totally. And, you know, once again, getting back, uh, you know, into the, you know, concept of sound, a lot of people don't realize, but this is a quote from a long time ago from the New York Times science section, and it says, sound shaped into dazzling tool can make, break, or rearrange molecular structure and levitate objects. Now, this, I didn't make this up. This came from the New York Times, and it's talking about the power of sound. So I really feel that sound coupled with, you know, intentionality, with meditation, is one of the key, uh, if you like, uh, formulas for our, like, being in a state of grace. And it's just so very, very important. And what an opportunity for me to uh, be able to present uh, to you and uh, your listeners this, uh, what I call... uh, an enhanced conscious listening experience, which is actually something that I have not done before in this particular manner, but uh, uh, we're actually going to be listening to a piece of music from my Chakra Chance uh, recording uh, called Angelic Calling, which is the uh, works with the energy of the uh, crown chakra, but also simultaneously the heart chakra and the energy of the Om sound and many, many other sounds. And uh, it features myself and my wife. Andy and our dear beloved uh, friend Sarah Benson, who is now operating herself on the angelic realms, but she said something that I want to share with you and all your listeners. The true sound of healing is love. The true sound of healing is love. Gosh, that makes sense, doesn't it? Because when we, oneness is really the the form, but the essence is love. It's, it's said over and over again over the history of, t- of time that this is true. So if love is the essence, then love is also the frequency that creates healing, isn't it? Indeed. And with that one, how about we begin having this uh, little experience, uh, listening to some sound, and then we'll get back to it talking. But uh, listeners, it's going to be a that three minutes long, which you're really going to enjoy it. And I'm going to begin by just guiding you a little bit and a little bit of a sort of a meditation idea. And then we'll just listen for a couple of minutes and then get back with each other. Steve, how does that sound? That sounds perfect. Looking forward to this piece that you've created for Global Oneness Day here, Jonathan. Thank you. All right, here we go. So I'd like you to take a couple of deep breaths, very slow deep breaths as you begin to listen to this music. And as you're taking these deep breaths, feel the breath actually going in and out through your heart. Feel this energy going in and out through your heart as you're breathing. And now, Think of something that you feel gratitude and appreciation for. It can be an offspring or a pet or a beautiful day, but something that you really feel gratitude for 
It's so important. And now, as you continue listening to this music, visualize a beautiful energy of pink and gold going out from yourself and interfacing with the field of the Gaia Matrix, the energy of our Mother Earth. Know that this energy is helping bring great consciousness to all beings on our planet. I just have to say that it's so, from my perspective, you know, people always, you know, talk about music, this, and, you know, uh, um, music has, you know, charms to uh, soothe the uh, savage beast or whatever, but really music also has the ability, and sound overall has the ability of bringing us into that state of oneness that, as you pointed out, we already are, but by gosh and by golly, what a wonderful tool it is and we just simply have to be you know aware of using music that's slow and has positive if you like energetic uh energy to it because by gosh and by golly that's uh that's really important uh you know uh, when we are if you like trying to interface and be as one indeed Yes, and this this music, this particular piece you chose, oh my goodness! But uh, just the the sound healing music that you produce, Jonathan, it really helps us to feel into this divine oneness, doesn't it? It does. Uh, I, I'm just amazed when I as I listen to your CDs and tapes and hear about your workshops and things that um, just bring us into this beautiful place of real connection, of real embodiment and expression you know of, of radiating uh the one oneness which is the divine well thank you steve i mean it's so interesting because this, this recording you know won a number of different awards shocker chance um you know close to 20 years ago and then it was just recently voted uh most iconic album of all time uh, meaning that for some reason uh people still really you know i i, I guess it uh, it's got a lot of staying power so to speak or a lot of love well <laughs> A lot of love, a lot of talent, and I just want to share uh, for people that don't know, Jonathan's uh, father was one of the people that created plastic surgery, uh, and uh, of course, uh, and his brother is also uh, a professional that's on that uh, 
kind of path. And so there was this opportunity for worldly treasure to uh, go down that path. But instead, you created this whole sound healing association, this uh, spirit music, all of these things that you've done with your wife, Andy, that are bringing this this healing music out in the world. And there's there's no doubt but that you've played a role in awakening oneness and uh, helping people to really feel into and live into oneness. Jonathan, I just want to thank you for that. Oh, thank you so much, Steve. And if people want to find out more, go to healingsounds.com. And I know that you need to uh, begin uh, to um, vibrate to the, our next uh, uh, visitor to this wonderful plane of existence for a Global Oneness Day. So I want to thank you again for this opportunity. You bet. Well, thank you for being here with me. And again, World Sound Healing Day on uh, Valentine's Day. Put that one on your calendar. We always participate in that with Jonathan as well. It's just a really beautiful and healing experience. Uh, So thank you again, Jonathan. Gosh, just such a pleasure to be with you. If you'd like to receive all of our new podcast episodes, please click on the subscribe button. To find out more about Humanities Team transformational education programs and about how you can help support our mission, please visit us online at humanitiesteam.org, where you can also sign up for our email list so we can let you know about our free online events and other news about what we're up to each week. And again, if you enjoyed this podcast, please leave us a review. Thank you.